looking into data acquisition once the design file settings have been appropriately set the user can then proceed with the project to import survey data you'll typically work with field books to create a new field book right click new that will create a new field book from here the user has the ability to go to the data files and click new to import data files or use Microsoft Windows drag and drop techniques to import data. Typically the user would create or import control data to begin with in a survey project. Control points can be added individually, they can be selected from the microstation screen or they can be imported from an existing data file. The data file I shall import now is a GEOPAC CTL which is a control file. In this situation we will go to Windows Explorer, select the appropriate control file and drag and drop that file to the data panel. Immediately the data is imported into the project can see the listing in the element list of the uh, of the control points that were added and in this case it was automatically triangulated and displayed the triangulation uh, displayed to disable the display of the triangulation we toggle off the surfaces we can also see a listing of point features that were associated to those control points and we will note that the point feature in red was not found in our feature styles list. The next step in the process may be to import a raw survey file, in this case an RW5. Again, drag and drop. If we zoom in on this particular data, this piece of data, notice that the list of points features has significantly extended. The dashed purple lines are the observations. We can see that from this particular data file there were three setups and for each setup we can take a look at the occupy point, the backside point and the listings of observations. The data within the observations can be edited from this panel or bulk edited. Automatically the graphical elements are created and the annotation is based on both the details from the styles and the microstation annotation scale. To rescale the text height we simply reset the microstation annotation scale. Additional data files can be dragged and dropped they can be multi-file selected, in this case two, drag and drop those in. We now see that we have three data files in this particular project. If the order that the data files are to be processed is important, then the user should drag the files in one at a time in the correct order that they should be processed.